Two years ago, there was, this was just a grass field. And now it's saving lives in a real way. Banff is not only stands Bold Advanced Medical Future, we are also Bold Advanced Medical Force to really realize the precision medicine for our patients. And we are making a difference in the first six months we've been open. And we're going to continue to grow and we're going to continue to make more of a difference. We're watching these patients walk in. Well, they're not walking in, they're being wheeled in. They're probably weeks away from death. We want to be a good part of that journey because it's a hard journey. I think Banff Health in general, our role is to be a platform that we can expedite the new discoveries and get them to patients as quickly as possible. Because all that matters in this space is helping as many people as we can. Banff definitely hold a very unique expertise. We know how to build these kind of infrastructures for next generation radio pharmacies, large scale molecular imaging and the theranostic center over here. And we know how to run it. We built a pharmacy that was capable of producing a hundred different radio tracers in any given day. That's unique because the traditional commercial radio pharmacy is built really around optimizing the dispensing of one drug per day. Having the radio pharmacy next to the clinic, we are able to make the drugs which help the clinic to do the diagnostic. But it also has excess capacity so we can bring that technology to the community around us. We have two cyclotrons, which is also a big advantage to the site. There is a tremendous ability to treat a whole lot of different types of cancer, and then to go even beyond just oncology and look at Alzheimer's and Parkinson's and PTSD and other disease types. I think that what drew me to Banff Health is all the incredible things that they envision of doing and are currently doing. We designed a facility for the patient and the people who take care of the patients and also the people who support the people who take care of the patients. My approach for caring for patients is just to really think about every facet or aspect about what they would need uh, and how they are at the moment when you're interacting with them. We approach patient care as if it's your family member sitting across from you. I mean, it's literally my mom sitting across from me, my dad sitting across from me, and you just do a better job. You care more, you work harder. Every single person that they interact with, um, again, treats them with that dignity and respect, knowing that they're coming here for potentially difficult conversation. We get them settled into a room, and that will be their room for the day. It's beautiful, it's bright. We're just trying to really go above and beyond and do what we can to make this a seamless process for them and to make them comfortable and to make them feel like they're really part of the BAMP family. We have the ability to sequence more patients through safely than really any other facility in the Midwest at this point. We want these therapies to be as safe as ever, as expeditious as ever, getting these new novel therapies to patients as quickly as possible, and that's what Banff Health is set to do. And we have all the tools from an imaging perspective, from a team perspective, from a care perspective, to ensure that we are playing our part. Right now there is only one Banff, but we're looking to expand. And the goal is to really be able to cater to as much of a population, uh, not only in the US, but all around the world. We want to be bold, we want to be advanced, we want to create this medical future um, that's going to happen tomorrow, not years from now. I'm so fortunate to have find a group of people share this vision, understand how important this mission is, and passionate about this. There's a lot of fresh perspectives on the team, and everybody has so much desire to make an impact on what we're doing. When I walk around this building, and I do get chills, I still do literally every time I walk around here. I think BAMP is a tiny sign of hope, but I think it is much more than that. Just because I think we have the passion to help patients become people again.